for the brief of the project, um, the family uh, already had a beach house at Omaha, actually in the same street, so when the site came up it was the um, last sort of beach frontage uh, site available. The brief for this one was to have all of the living on one level, including um, children's area, and to wrap the whole living space around a lawn and a pool area, which could be used for, as the sun moves around the building, it's um, protected from the wind and it gets the afternoon light as well. Developing up the project, um, we were interested again in a courtyard style house. It's a strategy we'd used before for these um, beach houses due to quite um, strong winds coming in from both uh, the seaward direction but also um, southwest a cold wind that can come in from the other side. So in this house we wanted to um, bring the primary living dining area out at the, the seaward end of the property and gain the, the view but also to uh, look back into uh, the courtyard lawn and pool and have a connection back into that as a sort of total indoor outdoor flow. using Chant for architectural hardware for several um, major houses that we've done in the last few years. Uh, what we love about them is the really high quality product which is made in New Zealand. Another uh, good aspect of the hardware is the um, solid brass construction but also the wide range of finishing that we can get anywhere through from a natural brass lock through to black and a whole range of bronze finishes. I think one of my favourite parts of this house is, is really the uh, continuous uh, wrapping of forms. So we've um, taken um, predominantly the cedar cladding and it carries up a wall and then it becomes a, a ceiling treatment or a sort of roof overhang and, and then the really uh, dramatic piece of the two storey high freestanding sun canopy that runs across the western side of the house. So it was a lot of engineering went into that to sort of make this uh, exciting form. I think this, this is a very contemporary beach house, but I also think it's, it's uh, quite classic and um, simple lines and uh, should be you know, very enduring. I'd hope this house looks just as great in uh, 10 or 20 years as it did the day it was built.